It's my birthday celebration and I'm about to get ready, but I wanted to show you my outfit. I got this top from Aritzia. I wasn't sure about the color, but I absolutely love it. This necklace I got a long time ago at the Bay. I'm Canadian if you don't know already. These pants are from Aritzia. They're the cargo pants. Yeah, they're the cargo pants. And this blazer is last year's from Zara. And I think they may have this because they've had this a couple years in a row. Right, so the foundation I'm gonna use today is the Easy Bake, no, Easy Blur foundation. This is by Huda Beauty. And I've used this a couple times and then I kind of forgot about it because I haven't been wearing makeup. I've been giving myself a little bit of a break. I hope this matches. We'll see. It's gonna be dim lighting. So if it doesn't match perfect, that's okay. Is that okay? I'm a little red because I've been running around. I'm going out to dinner with two of my children. Unfortunately, the other two can't make it, but that's okay. I'm not one to really celebrate my birthday that much. Am I the only one? I'm at, I know I'm not the only one because my mom is the same. I like giving gifts and I like celebrating everybody else. But for me, I kind of don't want to put anyone out. You know, it's a thing. All I need is a happy birthday from my family, not from everybody, but you know, family's nice and to be remembered but I don't need a lot of attention. I never have been that way. My mom said that when I was little, I didn't like opening gifts in front of people and I'm still that way. What's next? Bronzer, I have to get ready really fast because I think I have to go in 10 minutes. A guy came to my door. He was trying to get business because the people that lived here before, he used to do their driveway for the snow, the snow removal. He was interesting. I don't know how we got on the topic of drinking and bad decisions and how he's lucky he didn't have a phone and the social media and the access to all the things back then. And started telling me a story about how this man went after work to talk to this woman. And this was before texting and a picture before he even got home, got to his wife that he was out to dinner with this woman. And it was just innocent, you know. For the life of me, I don't know how that conversation started. I feel like when he went away from the conversation, he was probably kicking himself thinking, why? Why did I talk about that? Why did I tell that story? Came here looking for business and he told me 20 year old gossip. Maybe he was a nervous talker. Oh, by the way, I am using Makeup Forever Wild Sand. I really like this color of this top. It's so pretty. I haven't worn green a lot because my husband doesn't really love green, but then I realized I like it. So I decided to wear green. Not all greens look good on me, but I'm so tired of wearing black and blue. And I think this looks good. Let me know what you think. What would go nice with this? Yeah, let's try this one. This is House Labs Glassy Hibiscus. Let's try this one. I'm going to use a Sigma F89. Anyway, we moved to this small town and we want to support local. So we may use them. I'm not sure. I'm really not in charge of those decisions. Oh, and another thing. I hope they never watch this. He's a farmer and he sells beef. Well, I've been saying lately that I could be vegetarian. And when he was talking about it, I just about, I just about wanted to, it gave me a tight feeling in my throat because he was talking about how young they get him. Woo! I don't know. We have mice in our house and I'm having a hard time getting rid of the mice. Like, I don't want them here, but I'm just praying for them to leave so they don't have to die. We have somebody coming. Oh, I'm putting blush on my forehead. What am I? I? That doesn't look bad. Yeah. So I'm praying for them to leave so they don't have to die. I caught one yesterday. I don't want their pee and poop all over my house. Oh, by the way, this ring, I got this on the cruise a couple years ago when I went with a bunch of ladies from TikTok. It's so pretty. I will find a link for you. I'm sure I can still find it, but it switches. What color looks better? I think the green. Oh, I forgot. I got new concealer. This is the Studio Radiance 24 hour luminous concealer, luminous lift concealer. I got two colors. I got NW11. I used to be NW20 and now I am NW11. So be sure not to order your original color that you used to be in MAC because they've changed. Is that going to be too light? Well, we'll see. Just pop it right in there and I'm going to let it sit for a second. I haven't tried it yet. I only just tried it on my hand in the store. Just putting a bit down my nose to highlight a bit on my chin and a bit here just to bring the light to the center of my face. Oh, my forehead's looking pretty red, isn't it? Let's tame that down just a little bit. 
and I'm blurring out the edges and toning down that redness just a little bit there. I keep saying just a little bit, but it is just a little bit. Hey, what's that song? Yeah, it's a rap song that probably is a bit dirty, so I won't say that. <laughs> Same brush, just going underneath. A little bit on my lid. And blend. That looks good. I've been having a tough time lately and today I decided to take a break and it was good. I feel like I have a reset and my mood is better. And I was trying to remember why I started this. What do I love about creating videos? And what created the success in the beginning? And I remembered that I didn't have a plan. I just got on here and did my thing. And I did what I felt that day with no expectations of the outcome. And I think that's when I did my best and that's when I was the happiest, honestly. This is Huda Beauty Easy Bake. There's my husband, shoot. Ah, no. This is gonna have to be an easy eyeshadow look. So I'm gonna go into these two colors. This is Dior. And just put it all over my lid. I'm gonna have to fade out those dogs. And with the bronzer, but really simple. We don't wanna keep everybody waiting. What are you wearing, Lindsay says. Oh God, let me answer her in a minute. Almost done guys, almost done. I'm always in a hurry and I think sometimes that's the best makeup. I'm not being very specific with it. It doesn't have to be complicated. I always say that. It really doesn't. Sigma brush with the same bronzer. My hair is getting in the way as my eyeshadow. And right there, just under. And I put more pressure on the outer corner and lift up on the pressure in there. So I just ordered a bunch of stuff from Aritzia and I'm going to do a try on hopefully tomorrow. I wish I had time to do it tonight, but I got it later in the day. I always wait to the last minute to do lips. I'm going to use Beige Turner by MAC. And the lips get bigger. Brave red. I love to wear red. Let's go with a bit of mascara because I can't decide. Curl the lash. Yeah, so anyway, we're getting to know our neighbors. What an odd conversation that was. Not judging. What we were talking about was drinking back in the day and not having record of it. And then that story must have popped up in his mind. And he told me the story that popped up in his mind. Because that was in the beginning when having record of it was actually a thing. And people had to start being careful. This guy was innocent. That's what he said. Innocently talking to a coworker after work. However, it didn't look very good. And someone let the wife know. I always say the way you act and the way you treat people should be something you're always proud of. Act like somebody's watching because they probably are. Even if it's a text, even if it's a message, if there's a record of it, somebody can find it. So be nice, behave, don't do anything that you wouldn't want somebody to know, like your wife or your husband or your children or your boss. And don't do anything that you wouldn't want done to you. That's a safe way to be. I think social media potentially has made people behave better out of fear of being caught doing something wrong. The other part of the story is the man didn't tell the wife the truth. So she knew that he was out. This is 20 years ago, by the way. She knew that he was out before he even got home and he didn't fess up. Lies will always find you. NYX brow pen and taupe. And actually, I'm going to get this in blonde because I feel like it might be better in blonde or maybe even a mix of the two. That looks okay. Does it? I think I need a little powder just to fill in the holes. This is the Benefit Brow Powder. I kind of wish I had a lighter color. Just filling in a little bit of the holes to soften it really.
lips. What am I doing? I still don't know. My husband's gonna kill me. Maybe a little bit of this right here. Right here. And some Chanel. Yeah. I'm gonna let that sit off camera, put the sealer on after. This stuff stays, by the way. Let me know what you think, and I'll see you later. Bye.